I'm singing, I'm in a store and I'm singing, I'm in a store and I'm singing! Hello everybody, welcome back to Undertale! This is the second episode, and um... Looks like there's some uh, spaghetti here. I don't remember if I saw this. I think I did. Um, um, I don't remember. It's been a while since I've recorded, so sorry if the voices are different, because it's been a while. Warning. Dog, dog marriage? What? <laughs> um, okay. What's over here? Whoa! Lesser dog appears. Pet, 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 pet. Okay. Hmm. Which one will I do? Pet. You barely lifted your hand unless your dog gets excited. <laughs> Hi, doggy. Oh, you're adorable. Lesser dog is barking excitedly. Okay, cool. I can spare it. Yay. Wait, what happened to its neck? Hmm. <laughs> Weird. Okay, there's nothing over here. So what is down here? Wee, this is fun. Doo -doo -doo. Ooh, an X. I can't do anything with it. What is this? Oh, this looks like a map. Okay, so apparently I need to go back to that little area <laughs> that I just went to. Right here. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Okay. Wonder what that did. It did something. It made the spikes go away. Yay! Oh. Hi! <laughs> What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Ooh. I like the music. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Doggy, assault you. Dog Amy and Dog Arisa. They're cute. Um, pet, roll around and re sniff. Re sniff. The dogs sniff you again. But you smell just as weird as before. Hmm? What's that smell? Smell mystery. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, right, I have to stop for the blue attacks, right? I have to imagine a blue stop sign. Okay. Um,. So, let's pet you. The, the dog Arisa is too suspicious of your smell. Stop! Don't touch her! Beware of dog. Yeah. Ah. You will not get me with your weird hearts that come out of your mouth. <laughs> the, the dogs keep shifting their axes to protect each other. Oh, they're cute. Um, maybe if I roll around, then I, I will smell like a weird puppy, apparently. <laughs> let's kick human tail. Do humans have tails? I don't think so. Elliot, do you have a tail? No. Oh. <laughs> ah, I keep dying. The dogs may want- Oh, okay, so now I can let them re-smell me. Yay, I smell all right. Are you actually a little puppy? Whoa, 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 whoa! Wow, I can't believe I did that. Um, maybe I can pet them. You pet the dog Arisa. What about me? A dog that pets dogs, amazing! Don't die! <laughs> okay. Woo! Do I have to pet you now, too? Okay. Wow, well, pet by another pup! Well, don't leave. I already petted you! <laughs> now I can spare them! Woo! I am low health. The new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. I'm a weird puppy, apparently. I need to save. I have low health. Um, let's go back and save, because I don't want to die. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully I don't run into anything. That would suck. Watch me, like, run into something right now. I honestly expected to run into something. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Okay. <clears throat> let's go back to place. What is this? There's an X. And another X. Turn every X into an O and then press the switch. Um. 
Oh. Well, I messed up. Okay. So that's easy. Just walk. Oh, hi, Papyrus! What? How did you afford my truff? And, more importantly, is there any left for me? Why do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Um, sure, I left it. I can be honest, and you won't be hurt. Really? Wowie! You resisted the flavor of my home-cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. Nya, Wait. Nya. That, that doesn't sound weird. I'm so used to him saying nya. That's funny. Okay. And then the spikes are gone. Hi! My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah. Okay. Oh, here's another one of these puzzles. Human! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face! <laughs> Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. Nice going, Papyrus. <laughs> and, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I'm saying is, worry not, human! I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed! Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Okay. Um, looks simple enough. Um. Um. There we go. Yeah, that was easy. I don't need your help, Papyrus! I got this! Ha! Boop. Wow! You solved it! And you did it without my help! Incredible! I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do! Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then! I might even be too easy for you! Yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I like Papyrus, he's funny. Sans! Hi! Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Well, you weren't even there! <laughs> Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Okay. <laughs> I like the music. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Alphys! You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they'll begin to change color! Each color has a different function. Red tiles are invincible! You cannot walk on them! Yellow tiles are electric! They will electrocute you! Green tiles are alarm tiles! If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster! Orange tiles are orange scented! They will make you smell delicious! Blue tiles are water tiles! Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you! Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you! Purple tiles are slippery! You will slide to the next tile! However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which Piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Not. At. All. I don't want to hear explain it again, though. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna wing it. <laughs> Great, then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before! Not even I will know the solution! Get her ready! Whoa. Oh god, I'm gonna fail at this. <laughs> well! Spins away casually. I love it. This is this is a hard puzzle. I can't solve it. What's this? The machine isn't working. Sans! Actually, that spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. <laughs> Hello! You are a dog. 
Do you have your tongue stuck? This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. What's this? On the floor inside is a box of pomeranians. raisins. <laughs> there are lots of dog jokes. Aware of dog, please pet dog. Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. I know. You look like a diva. That dog considers itself an artist, but will never know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. <laughs> I like the word kibble. Oi. This looks hard. Um. Let's wing it! Oh gosh. I failed this, didn't I? Maybe. 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 Oh no! Yep, I failed it. <laughs> it's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it in red marker. <laughs> it's a snow papyrus. <laughs> oh, sands. Um, let me think about this. Okay. Oh gosh, I messed up again. Okay, one more time, and then I will get it. Okay, there, there. I like how you just slide across the ice. Um, let's do this. Ah, I see. Okay, there we go. Woo! Okay. Woo! following me. It's a door! It's a door! Oh gosh. I have a feeling it's like some combination that I need to get. But I don't know it! I'll go back to this later. Whee! Okay. Hello, Sans. Do you say anything different? No, you say the same thing. Look at those creepy eyes. Look at those creepy. Sands! Okay. This way. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. <laughs> what a tiny dog house! Oof. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff! <laughs> is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? <laughs> That's funny. It's a snow puff. <laughs> yep. Oh. I can't move. What? Is that a tail? Is that a, is that snow puff actually a dog? Ah, that bark was cute. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my gosh. This music is perfect. Um, pet. Granted, dog is too far away. You just pet the air. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Ah! I only recognize. The greater dog is watching you intently. Okay. Um, maybe beckon. You call the greater dog. It bounces towards you, flecking slobber into your face. <laughs> Don't bark at me. Don't bark at me with your murderous sparks. Greater dog is seeking affection. Okay, now I pet it then. Greater dog curls up in your lap. Aw, that's cute. Even though it's huge and wearing armor and has three faces. <laughs> it gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Zzz. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Oh! Ah! Oh! Aw, oh, man! Really? Really? Dang it! Is that the first time? I think that's the first time I died. You cannot give up just yet. Eddie! STAY DETERMINED! Okay. Do I have to do that puzzle again? Dang it, I do. 
Oh, wait, no. I wasn't ready. No! Dang it! That's an accident. I swear. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Whee! Ice skating. Whee! I love how I just stand perfectly still while I slide across. Boop! Boop, 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 boop. Whee! And then here comes the path. Whee! Then I'll have a snow house on my head. Yay! Okay. This way, snow pops. Do I have to collect the 30G again? It was in this one, right? Yeah. What? Oh, come on, it's repeating the dialogue again. Ah, Lame. Blah, 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 blah. I know that it's a snow puff. Yay. Okay. Now I got the 30G. Let's go and fight you, greater dog. Oh, the tail. Hello. <laughs> Alright. So now I think I know what to do. Let's beckon. And bounce sword, you fucking slobber. La la la. Don't bark at me! Stupid! Oh my god. Ser seriously? Seriously? Oh, how I. Nice cream. Yay. Okay. Don't you bark at me! Okay, so now I pet you. Yay! Oh! Ah! Can you, can you just do that attack every time? That's a lot easier. Wait, what What are you doing now? Greater Dog is patting the ground with its front paws. So it probably wants to play then, right? You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It's lots on the ground. Greater Dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Yes! Got it. Greater Dog wants some TLC! I will pet you! As you pet the dog, it sings its entire- Oh god, its entire weight into you! Your movement's slow. But you still haven't pet enough! Do I move slower now? Oh god! No! No! Pet capacity is 40%. Oh no. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its leg ha legs hanging in the air. Don't bark at me! Stupid dog! Greater dog is contented, so can I spare you? Woo! Yay! Now leave me alone. Oh. Okay, you're adorable. Oh, that's funny. Hmm. Whoa, that's really pretty. Let, let's just take a second to admire that. That's pretty. Ah, I feel like I could just meditate right here or something. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. I know that music! Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold! The Gauntlet of Deadly Terror! When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Um, <laughs> nothing's happening. There's a dog up there. The dog is too funny. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now! <laughs> no, no, it doesn't look very activated. Whoa! This challenge, it seems, maybe, too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am the skeleton with skender, ste uh, bleh, you, you read it. <laughs> my puzzles are very fair, and my traps expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. <laughs> Yay. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Huh. Huh? <laughs> Pretty new. That was funny. Hi, Sans. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. I do. Thanks. Oh, welcome to Snowden Town. Is that is that all a penguin? That's that's adorable. 
Oh, how cute! The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Woo! What is in my box again? Yeah. Butterscotch pie, toy knife, and stick. And the snowman piece of ice cream. I need some more food. Maybe the shop can have some. Hello. Hello, traveler. What can I help me? How can I help you? Let's talk. Hello. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden Town. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital. You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? I don't think I came from the capital. What to do here? You wanted to know what to do here in Snowden? Gilby's has food, and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can stay outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Yeah, I like them. They're funny. Town history. Think back to... Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back here, back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow through the un burrow under the door, forget about it. Okay, well I came from there, so yeah. Life is the same as usual, a little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Okay, now I want to buy stuff. Tough glove, manly bandana, bicycle, bike with an S, and cinnamon bun. Uh, this is a weapon, I don't need that. Uh, I don't, I'm, I'm not, I think I'm not going to kill anyone, because, you know, it's cool. Manly bandana. <laughs> okay, that's armor, so I could probably use that. I'll, I have, yeah, I can buy that. I'll also get some food, cinnamon bun. Uh, he, this is food? <laughs> you, he was, what? So, you can eat, eat it? What? I'm confused. Um, but apparently it's food, so I'll buy a few. Um, yeah, I think three's good. Okay, bye now. Come again sometime. Alright, let's save again. Just so, in case, I don't know, I crash or something. Let's check out the inn. Welcome to Snow Inn. Snow Inn's premier hotel. One night is 80G. I don't have 80G. Well, free, free, feel free to come back anytime. Hi. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. Really? What's maximum HP? Oh, okay. I want to. Oh, I don't even have enough gold, so. Oh well. What's this? <laughs> don't want to walk to the other side of Snowden Town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. Whoa! Whoa! Well, I want to see everything, so I'm gonna go back. That's cool, though. Hi. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. <laughs> Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee -hee. <laughs> Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath the decorated tree. Is that why Christmas is a thing? It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to the various locals. <laughs> so, so apparently they have they they just thought of Christmas themselves too. <laughs> Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. <laughs> apparently, kids wear striped shirts. Hi. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. <laughs> That's politics. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm assuming by skeleton you're talking about one of the, um, the skeleton brothers. <laughs> Alright. This is Sans music. Sans gonna be here. Hi! No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and the, the hot guys! <laughs> oh my god, you're terrifying. 
Hi, friend. Mm. Zach, is, isn't human food different from monster food? It doesn't. It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> what, what does monster food do, then? You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. <laughs> oh, you're talking about Greater Dog? Oh my gosh. There he is, yeah. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. <laughs> we love bones. Well, you are dogs. <laughs> that was funny. Hi. Didn't I fight you? I'm thinking of getting a spiked collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash for me and take me for a walk, please. <laughs> it's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. <laughs> I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Uh, I'm gonna stay far away from you. You're scary. Actually, I want to talk to this person. Those darks are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. <laughs> Silence. Grilbz said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. <laughs> Who are you? The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip into their butts. <laughs> what? The jukebox is broken. Okay, I'm done. You look really <laughs> not happy. <laughs> Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crises. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. <laughs> we all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? What's up here? I don't look up here real quick. Let's play monsters and humans! You aren't gonna make me be human again, are you? I'll be the human. Aw, oh, to be young again. The world it sure felt boundless. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. <laughs> ah, my patience rewards me. So, you're not gonna let me in? Hi. I'm gonna walk away slowly now. This is creepy. Let's go back to Snowden Town. <laughs> Library. Li Library. Library. Hi. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. That look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? Isn't that what I picked for the thingy? I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Yay! <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. What are these? Can I read these? It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, te technically speaking, are cool as heck. <laughs> when monsters get old and t kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take the dust and spread it on the person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? <laughs> I'm kind of sick of writing this. While monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us, but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Um, well, I actually have to go, so I'll- don't worry, I'll read the other books later. I just need to go save real quick. Now I see why they put that underground thingy thing. Um, okay. Eh. Out of my way! Saving point. Boop! 
Okay, well, thank you everybody for watching. Uh, I'll be doing the next episode soon, hopefully. And um, I'll see you next time. Bye! Don't forget to like and stuff. Bye!